Welcome back to SPR Daily MLB Odds Report. Today there are six games that our resident handicappers are tracking closely, and they've provided us with their top value picks of the day, starting with the game between the Atlanta Braves and the Pittsburgh Pirates. The Braves are starting to play better, having won three straight games, but unfortunately for them, they're still trailing in the Red Hot Nationals by six games for the first place in the division. The wins need to keep coming for Atlanta, so it's a good thing that they have Irvin Santana pitching tonight. He's been excellent going 12 and 6 with a 3.66 ERA on the season. Pittsburgh's Vance Worley hasn't been too shabby either, but ultimately Willie is siding with the road team in this spot. Now the other game that we have here is the LA Angels against the Boston Red Sox, and it's a dead even heat in the AL West right now, with the Angels and the Athletics in a tie atop the division. The Angels turn to left-hander CJ Wilson for tonight's game at Fenway. He's 9-8 with a 4.71 ERA so far in 2014, with Boston's Brandon Workman set to take the bump for the home team. The Red Sox have gone 29-33 at Fenway this season. With his preferred MLB pick, Willie has opted to back the under in thinking that the two pitchers can at least be solid out there tonight. The other game that we have here is the Cincinnati Reds against the St. Louis Cardinals. And at this point, you never really know what you're going to get out of Justin Masterson. One start, he's getting absolutely tormented, and then the other, he looks pretty much unhittable. That kind of uncertainty makes handicapping extremely difficult. Masterson has gone 2 and 1 with a 6 ERA so far with the Cardinals, while Cincinnati's Mike Leak has gone 9 and 11 with a 3.59 ERA. There are two different recommended picks for tonight's game at Bush Stadium. As Ron is on the Reds, as underdogs, while Jeff has decided to add the St. Louis Cardinals to his MLB picks, but he's taking them for the first five innings. And now the other game that we have is the Arizona Diamondbacks against the Washington Nationals. And if we strictly go by the pitching matchup, the edge is clearly with Jordan Zimmerman and the Nationals. Zimmerman has been enjoying another solid campaign for the division leaders. Nuno has performed better for Arizona than he did with the Yankees, but he's still yet to record a winning decision. With that being said, we cannot be shocked with the slightest decision that Ross is making by banking on the comfortable Washington win by two or more runs. Now the other game that we have is the Baltimore Orioles against the Chicago White Sox, and Chris Sale was as dominant as ever in his latest start, allowing four hits and zero earned runs while striking out 12 batters over eight innings in San Francisco. He's now 10-2 with a 2.01 ERA on the year. For Baltimore, Bud Norris will pick up the starting assignment. The Orioles are seven games up in the AL East, thanks in large part to an excellent 36-26 road record on the road. Will the division leaders get yet another victory tonight? Perhaps, but in the end, Ross thinks that there's more value on the over seven runs. And last but not least, we got the Seattle Mariners against the Philadelphia Phillies. In his Phillies debut, Jerome Williams had a pretty good outing, but we're not expecting that kind of success to continue. We've gotten a large enough sample size to see what Williams is capable of doing or not. Ruinus Elias is on the mound for Seattle, and he'll lead out the road team as clear-cut MLB betting favorites. The price right now can be found between 150 and minus 160 range, and that's valuation that Jeff is more than willing to jump on. Well, that's all we have for today, so make sure to check back with us tomorrow for another episode of SBR Daily MLB Odds Update, where we'll give you the insider picks from our resident handicappers. For sportsbookreview.com, this is Dax Floyd.